Stroke usually means two types of stroke. Stroke we mean that the blood supply to the brain is either affected, that means it is cut short, or there is a sudden breakage in the blood vessel which we call as hemorrhagic stroke. Where the more common one is when the blood supply gets cut off to the brain. But the indications of a stroke, for example in a hemorrhagic stroke, is that you usually get sudden headache and sudden loss of sensorium or consciousness, which we call as hemorrhagic stroke. The treatment depends a lot on how early you reach the hospital. Similarly, the ischemic stroke, where the blood supply is cut off to the brain, that time there are certain indications from a, an individual. That means whether you can identify stroke very early is best identified by change in face, where the face becomes a little uh, crooked or it goes to one side when he is talking or when he is trying to eat something and you find that the face has become slightly crooked or he is not able to utter a word or not very clearly, the speech is not clear clearly. In addition, if there is sometimes there is weakness of either arm, that means it may be the left side or the right side or even the left arm and leg, both can be involved at the same time. But all these have to be identified very early because the time is of the most important principle because that's why this is given an acronym called FAST that is face, arm, speech and time all put together that as early as you identify you can possibly change the course of ischemic stroke today. In few years, till few years ago, maybe even 25 years ago, we did not have any specific modality of treatment. But today we are able to provide very efficient treatment for stroke to see that no damage occurs to the brain provided the patient reaches a hospital which can take, cater to this sort of treatment at the earliest. In similarly, if the best treatment initially is possibly what we call as thrombolysis where we give a drug to clot to bust the clot. But sometimes in spite of the fact that people too come early and you give this drug, only about 35 to 40 percent of patients do benefit. So in addition of, of late, in the last two years, there has been additional advantage of what we call as a thrombectomy, where we can mechanically remove the thrombus from the blood vessel which it is clotting. And if you can do it within the first few hours, we can prevent damage and make the person completely recover. So it's very important that in stroke, either hemorrhagic or ischemic, that the person reaches a center where he can get adequate treatment at the earliest. The time is of essence and unless this is understood by everyone, that means everybody who wants to be treated or as well as those who are going to attend to patients, that this is very, very much the requirement that the patient suspected to have a stroke. As I told you earlier, you suspect whenever there is change in the face, speech or in weakness of any of the legs, the patient has to be immediately rushed to the hospital so that the adequate treatment can be given to prevent further damage to the brain. Thank you. Mm -hmm.